Hello, my name is Aaron Harris and this is my This Is Me video. On August 10, 2003, I was born in Michigan, Detroit, Michigan, where I was birthed with my mom and my dad. At this time, I was living with my dad in uh, Detroit when we were all together. And then four years later, me and my, uh, my parents had a divorce. While I was born in Detroit with my mom and my dad, my two other brothers, Adrian and Anthony, my parents decided to split when I was at the age of five years old. This resulted into me living with my mom, with my dad, with my brothers, Adrian and Anthony, who are both older than me, 10 years, which is my other brother, Adrian, and my brother, Anthony, is older than me by t seven years. While I was young and in a new environment, I got into sports so I could make friends throughout that new environment and make it way more easier to make friends throughout school. So I, took, I started playing baseball for like a year in uh, kindergarten throughout 2009, throughout 2011. And then after that, I started to fall into a, a lovely sport called so uh, soccer. When I played soccer, I was in soccer for more than 10 years, all the way up until my junior year of high school. Throughout high school, I didn't really know what I wanted to do like to like after high school. I had no plans of like college and I was just really focused on uh, soccer until COVID year. That's when it all struck and we were forced to stay inside and figure out what we had to do with our lives because soccer slowed down and I did not I was not able to get my senior season. So this led me to contemplate on what should I do for further for my further plans. This then led me to look into colleges and look into what I would like to do. I knew I didn't want to do anything like really like too much writing or too much tech or I didn't want to go into law school or definitely not medical school because medical school, I was not too good at school at the time. I was just, I think I graduated high school with a 2.3 and I was pretty much done with like all like the book work and stuff. So I decided to go into film school at Grand Canyon University. Grand Canyon University reached out to me and I figured out that it would be a really good opportunity because of the price and how far it was from home and uh, how how I can get like the best experience out like furthest from home and really build like myself. While I was in school, I decided to make a whole new uh, friend group of just a bunch of entrepreneurs and people like like minded like me in the creative space, so that way I could further all my goals. Throughout my freshman year, I learned how to do photography and I learned how to edit. And when I got back home for the summer, I picked up my first full-time job as a demolition man and or demolition laborer, and I hated it. It was eight to 10 hour day, long, uh, hour long work days. We had to drive like an hour to work and it was just really tiring on the body. And this led me to get way more serious into photography than ever. At this time, I started to pick up more jobs on photography, whether it was senior portraits, family portraits, or event photos, I was doing it and I was editing it myself. Throughout this time, I started to grow up with my, of a portfolio for myself and working with Miles and working with Fashion Week. And then this led me to keep on going with school. Also, my senior year, I learned video editing and then I got into video production. And then this led me to opening up my second company, 3 on 3 Lee Productions, where I produce commercials and corporate events and uh, media coverage. While I got deeper into my production and photography career, this led me to make way more connections along the way and led me to build a team full of editors, photographers, and a bunch of people that I can call to help me with my creative needs in order to help me succeed. And also, my life relations really helped my life plan out to who, uh, what it is today and what I'm doing right now for my career and building my career strong. So when I get out of college, I have a bunch of stuff on my resume, all my clients that I worked with from the networking groups, and my creative friends that were here for me, uh, here with me at the day one of college are still here with me, helping me build up my business while I'm helping them build up theirs as a mutual relationship.